Hello guys, so Lucky Jake here. So welcome back to my YouTube channel. And for today, we are here on the bridge and we're having problem with the number one radar, which is the X-band radar. And sometimes it shuts by itself and we do not know yet what is the cause of the problem and we need to follow what is the manual is saying and for now i am going to check the condition of the monitor all the way to the control box and then we will move to the scanner so come and join me to this new learning So the first thing that I'm going to check is the condition of the CPU if it is overheating or not because this one is actually switching off by itself and then it will become normal it will run for like 10 hours 12 hours it depends and then it will restart by itself again so I was thinking that there is a problem with the scanner and but before that, I am going to check first the connection inside, if they are tight, if there is a loose one. After checking all the connections it seems everything is okay here and I'm already suspecting that there is something wrong with the scanner motor so we have two radars on board and that is the X-band and the S-band radar the S-band is the big one which has a long range and the X-band has the short range but it is good in using and taking some targets that's why they like to use the X-band radar most of the time Hello guys, so right now we are here in the Monkey Island. And I asked the crew if they can lower the mass, radar mass. This has this hydraulic jack which can be adjusted the height and the height of the scanner. So we will be op we will open that scanner so that we will see the condition inside how does it look like and what is happening in there so come on let's come up so we will open this up back cover and then we will see if the fan inside is running or not okay so the first thing that we will need to do is to check the fan inside if it is running or not so come on let's open this one
this is the motor and this is the forward one and that is the gear actually the gear is also worn out so the gear is worn out so that's why it's giving some noise sometimes see it's not anymore that fine and we and this is the motor this is the motor and we need to check the brushes inside if the motor brush are okay or not that is why I opened the front panel cleaning the brushes and putting them back so this is now the x-band radar so now it's working and we made an urgent requisition uh, for the brushes and I think they will also send technician for the gear to check the gear and for the replacement of that gearbox so that they can dismantle everything and make a thorough check on that one so I hope you learned something from this video and please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.